Spence Lewis for Inside Track News. I'm here hanging out with my buddy Jason Hathaway. We're talking all about the NASCAR Canadian Tire Series Western Swing. Back home in Ontario now, brother. I know it, uh, it was a wild week for you. Had a great run at, uh, at Motoplex Speedway out in Vernon, BC. We spoke about that. I want to talk all about Saskatoon Auto Claring Motor Speedway. I understand that it was, a, it was a pretty wild night for the Team 3 red car. Tell me all about it. Yeah, it was uh, definitely wild for sure. Uh, we had a good car. We had a good car all day in practice and uh, made a spring change uh, for qualifying, which hurt us a little bit, but uh, proved to be uh, the right change in the uh, in the race there. But uh, starting 15, handicapped us a bit, but uh, uh, we got up front. We took the lead for a while, led a bunch of laps. I think we led about 60 or 70 laps again and uh, ran up front with the guys and um, Got spun out late in, the, late in the going there and uh, had to come to the, I don't know, I think it came from 11th back up to 3rd with 20 to go. Uh, kind of put on a show, everybody from Snap On was there and uh, had some rock star people in the stands so they were all happy by the time it was all over so uh, everybody had fun. Now you mentioned auto clearing is the, is the type of speedway when we, when we spoke in the, in the pre-race interview that it's something that complements your style well, you roll in there almost expecting to, to run competitively. The next stop on the tour couldn't be any different. Than, than auto clearing and it's Santa Stash, a tight little bull ring. How do you do at Santa Stash? Is, is that a track that Jason Hathaway is comfortable at? Yeah, I can't wait to get there. We haven't been there in a few years, but uh, we ran well last time we were there. And I got a lot of laps around that place too. I ran a lot of laps in the Sportsman Series, the Cascar Sportsman Series, and uh, been there in an ACT car. Um, so, you know, I've been there in a few different cars, but uh, can't wait to get there. It's always good. They always pack the place and the fans are always great. So, can't wait to get down there and uh, put on a show again. Now, after the, the pair of performance that you had during the Western Swing, two podium finishes, that's got you right back in the point standings. You've got to be elated with, uh, with the way that your program has come together for the second half of the season. Yeah, it is. We're excited. Um, this is, you know, this gets middle of the season. It's kind of crunch time for everybody. This is what, uh, I guess, separates the, the, the men from the boys and uh, with all the preparation that needs to goes on coming home from the West. And our hauler just got home today about uh, 5 o'clock. So we're going to load tomorrow and uh, get working on the cars for next week. So then we're up to trois Rivière after that, uh, which will be another good show and uh, another long weekend. And then off to uh, Riverside, uh, Nova Scotia, which I always love going over there. And then you've got Barry and Kawartha to finish the season off with the five different tracks you guys are headed to. All of them are so different and have their own characteristics, their own challenges. Is there one track that you can point to that you're more looking forward to going to through the last five uh, events of the year? Probably Riverside. I really like going out there and uh, I'd love to, you know, to pick a track if I had to win in the next uh, next few events, uh, definitely Riverside would be the one. Uh, my buddy Donald Chisholm out there, I know he can throw a hell of a party, so if I win in his track, we might not get any sleep for a few days. Party till the birds start chirping at Riverside. Yeah, hell yeah, Donald Chisholm, he knows how to do it. Now, I know it's not possible without the right support and the right team behind you. Go ahead and thank the people that count. Oh, for sure. Rockstar does a great job uh, every week uh, showing me their support, sending the girls out, and uh, everybody it's a fan favorite every week. Uh, everybody wants a picture with the girls in the pink dress, so that's always great. Snap on Tools, big support. We had a lot of people in Saskatoon. We're going to have some people at Santa Stash again. We get to, I think we have 25 guests coming, so they're always great. Napoleon's a big-time supporter of ours for the last, uh, I think, five years, I guess it is, and uh, my owner, Ed Hackinson, always great. and uh, Never anything negative to say and always pumps us up, so that's always good to have for a car owner. Now, when you, when you look at the guys that hail from the province of Ontario, you've got a, a cult following amongst people that have followed you all the way from your super stock days to the late model, the sportsman, the NCAS tour, and we've got a couple of races that are coming up where you're out of province that they might not be able to get to the races to cheer you on in person, so how can they keep up with you from the safety of their own home? Uh, got to get me on Twitter. I'm always on there. Jay, Jason Hathaway 3 on Twitter. Uh, EHRRacing.com is our website, and uh, that's about it. There you have folks. He's going to be contending for the 2013 title when all is said and done. Driver of the number three machine in the NASCAR Canadian Tire Series is Jason Hathaway. Jay, thanks so much for the time. Right on, Spence. Good seeing you, bud.